Okay. I do not want to spit take all over my computer, Joe. <laughs> Set like a fucking bull. <laughs> Welcome to Bull Riding Simulator Wel- 2017. Welcome to Bull Riding v- to Goodbye Despair 2017. 2017. So last time the body discovery thing went off. Yeah, well, last time we had a fan service moment, and this time we're gonna look at Find out who's dead. <laughs> it does sound like he's nearby. He's not outside on the oh, beach. It's in, it's in the here. house. You really hear it coming from here? Yes. Oh yeah. By the way, I'm Chris Semester Four. Hi. <laughs> There's no reason for me to be nervous. A body discovery announcement. I don't believe it. Hi, Terry Terry's return. <laughs> Who would believe something like that? As I raise my voice, he swiftly stepped into the beach house. Objection. Ow. I won't believe. Goddamn, he is Terror Terror now. The moment I stepped inside the beach house, those words mercilessly she sl- sl- shattered into pieces. Oh fuck, it's a baseball. What the fuck? That's from the game, isn't it? A baseball. Yeah, oh, it's Mahiro. No! It's Mahiro. She's Why? Dead. What? The fuck is that thing? Wait, what? <clears throat> if this was all a dream. When did I when did I begin to dream? If this is reality, why is my hero on the floor covered in blood? Yeah, who the fuck would kill her? Well not only that, why is that mask there? And why was it a baseball bat? That was like the thing That's, in the game, yep, wasn't it? Someone someone watched the game. Watched the game. And I couldn't believe in anything. Well, that's it for that. Deadly life. Sea and punishment, sin and coconuts. What the fuck? Do you not read that from last time? Nope. My hero Koizumi, the ultimate photographer, is dead. <laughs> Had an unyielding boy <laughs> force of personality, but she was actually very good at taking care of people. How how is how is Kyo? Not Kyo. <laughs> How is Ow. Hiyoko going to tie her sash now? Hmm. How is Hiyoko going to tie her sash now? Hmm. I don't know. She'll learn. And she was always straightforward. Hmm. Mm. Ow, that actually hurt. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> I'm getting a scream out into the pillow. Hmm. One less voice for me to do, I guess. One less voice. <clears throat> it's actually it's kind of sad that it's Mahiro of all people who died. Yes, it is. Toward us and toward herself. She was always facing forward. She was that kind of person. <laughs> yeah, she never shoved her ass in your face. She never shoved her <laughs> ass, her ass in any of their... <laughs> Why her? Why Mahiro? Why? Because... She was taking pictures of dicks. Why did this happen to her? I don't know. Okay, the that's... The muscles in my face stiffened and grew hard. Don't take this out of context. This is supposed to be a serious moment, Joe. I wasn't. Don't poke me in the face. That was in your eyebrow. That is still part of the face. No, it's not. It's separate. It's separate. Darkness clouded my vision. Are you gonna faint? My legs started to wobble and instinctively placed my hand against the wall. Hey, Haji uh, Hajime. Before this, we were having a great time, right? We were excited about going to the beach. We were having a lot of fun. Hmm. Yeah, so the body discovery announcement played. So, me, Soda, and, uh, fucking Hiyoko saw the body. No, it played before that. No, it played before you saw the body. Then who else was there? Was he Sonya there? He didn't say Cause there three was... people had to find it. Yeah, he did. Did he? I'm pretty sure it's in the rules. Rules, rules, rules. Is it do three people have to find it? I think three people have to look find the body. Where is it? 
It doesn't say. We'll play as soon as three or more people discover the body for the first time. So who's the third per- So Yoko, Soda, who else would it have- It played as soon as we got there. No, it played when we got to the house. We hadn't seen the body yet. Oh, so three people already saw it before we did? So somebody else had to- the murderer, I guess. No, but- No, three people had to discover the body. Fuyuhiko! He was acting flustered, so he might have seen it. And just not said anything. Maybe, but... I guess? I don't know. Maybe that- hey, that does make sense as to why he just leaves so suddenly. So there's your three people. Hmm. Are you kidding me? Why did something like this happen? Someone tell me! But I obviously don't know what's going on either. Why didn't we go get everybody else? Huh? Um... <laughs> now it's not time to make bubbles! Hurry up and get the others! Bookie instantly left the beach house, still bubbling. I'm sure it took some time for everyone else to come here. He had a change and whatnot. It must have taken some time. But I didn't really know how much time had passed. My senses were numb. My emotions were also numbed. Within me, various layers were peeling off. Ew, that sounds disgusting! My senses were starting to return, around the time I realized that the others were already here. Huh? What the hell is this? <laughs> what? What? My Hero. The girls were standing outside the door leading to the beach, their faces pale with terror. Something like this. For, for heaven's sake, what in the world is going on? Their pale faces still intact, the girls began wobbling towards the beach house until a voice stopped them. Hold it. Hold on a second. Hmm. Those things beneath you. Be careful not to step on them. What? Beneath? See? You know, the footprints that in front of that door. There are footprints leading out of the beach house, right? They're probably an important clue. So don't step on them. Huh? If, if you mean evidence. Hmm. Monokuma mentioned it in the announcement, right? After a certain amount of time, we will hold a class trial. What the? Uh, another class trial? You serious? And are you saying this? That's right. Why don't you guys kill him, Joe? Stop putting- I can't- Then I'll just do this. I need to be able to lay my freaking elbow somewhere. On your mat. You fucking didn't want me to put it there before! But that's because you were- now, now you're not in my way of the mic. Anyway, read your line. Okay, then. One of you guys killed her! Killed? That's impossible. <laughs> Read it in the fucking voices, Why? you ass. Mm. Killed? That's impossible. Hey, hey. It's it's not like an a an accident or something. Lie. If you guys think that's an accident, that still means that this death was caused by someone else's actions, right? In other words, that also counts as a legitimate murder. No, it doesn't. What kind of fucking legal system is this? It's not a legal system. It's a, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a... Do such deaths fall into a gray area? Though, on this island, I'll make sure it's clear to you guys. On this island, dying from sickness is basically the only death that's not considered a murder. <laughs> well, it's impossible to get sick and die on this island. Not when Monami takes such good care of people. Hmm. What's this? Oh, speaking of which... There it is, the silent tripping attack. This is like the number one thing that hurts me. Yeah. Well, fine. I'm not gonna lose to your bashing. I decided to become a tough kid. <laughs> this is this is the worst. Once again, this horrible nightmare. Another victim. That's all because of Monokuma. No way. Jeez, it's not my fault. Huh? Well, whose fault is it then, you ask? Yeah. To find out, we will hold the class trial! So... Let's begin already! No whining, just begin already! It's the Monokuma file! I shall pass out this file! This should start to feel familiar! Do your best! Do your very best to investigate! I will see you at later at the class trial! <laughs> class trial... Investigation... This is horrible... Just too horrible... <laughs> Then you should have stopped the murder before it occurred. Do you have 
Don't you have that kind of power? <laughs> that I did have my power before he appeared. Perhaps, even if she tries to stop it, judging from Monokuma and Monami's relationship, there's no doubt she'd get stopped herself. <laughs> yeah, Monokuma took everything away, including the magic stick and the surveillance cameras. The only thing I can rely on are these ears, but they can only hear about three times out of a normal person. Basically, you have no idea what's happening on this island in the first place. I'm just the worst. A powerless rabbit like me is the worst. <laughs> it's funny because rabbits are supposed to be signs of good luck. Mm. Hey, now's not the time to focus on something like that. Well, she's half rabbit now because of Monokuma's change. More importantly, what what should we do? Uh, do we have to do it again? Yes. That cruel thing. We have. To do it again? Why? I'm surprised that it happened. I cannot this book. believe it. Mahiru was killed by one of us. Damn it! Yeah, I can't. I can't do this anymore. Investigating the class trial. Seriously, I'm done. Everyone feels the same, but we can't do anything else except do it. We can't. <laughs> we can't do anything else except do it. That's not what the line said at all. That is. Think. That is what the line said. No, it's not. We can't do anything else except do it. The hell. That's a really weird. It's we're, we're, weird. Weird. Weirdly worded sentence. There you go. And there's no way I could just ignore the reason my hero was killed. Hey. Yeah. The only thing we can do is investigate. Cause it's bad. Cause we should never <laughs> forgive that. Cause it's bad. This is true. Killing is something we should never forgive. Shiaki. Jesus. Well? The killer has their reasons. I understand that. It was the same for Terror Terror, too. It's really all Monokuma's fault. I understand that, too. But even so, mm. we should never forgive never allow it. killing. She usually has her head in the clouds, so for her to say something like that, well, she, she does feel very strongly about this, so... She probably, she probably likes, likes playing games like Fire Emblem, in which, uh, like, on the permadeath setting and preventing everyone from dying. Yep. So she would have the hardest task of all. Yep. Much like what Rob did at one point. But if that's that's true of me, too. Understood. Too. Regardless, everyone is going to die if we don't do it. In order for us all to survive, we must do it. I'm gonna do it! Then let's do this! Perhaps. Mihiru probably wants us to do this, too. She wants us to reveal the truth behind her death. <laughs> I understand. If everyone's doing it, I will do it too, but, but please give me a little time. Please give me time to calm myself down a little. Also, I will go and tell the others who aren't here about this. You're right. If you if all you heard was the announcement, you won't know where the murder took place. Hmm. This is really going to be that easy. We only have one building to investigate. <laughs> I, I shall excuse myself for now. <clears throat> Then let's begin. Who killed Mahiru Koizumi? Why was she killed? <laughs> we have to find it out and solve it already. We have to do it. It's the only way. <laughs> I don't. I don't want to do this, but that's more the reason for us to finish this. Does that mean we only have to search like this building? No. It's on the beach and the well, the the surrounding areas too. I'm the only one who can do this. We also have to relook at the game. Do we? Can we even do that? Probably. Dead. Covering up her chest and blood types. Um, 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 3 three p.m. So she died as soon as they got there. So we at least have alibis for all of the girls. No. Except for Hiyoko. No, she died at 3 p.m. She died around 3 p.m. Yes, they didn't arrive till 3.30. No. Yes. No. Yes, Ibuki got there with, um... Mikon at 3.30 because she wanted to eat a half hour before. We made this comment. 3.30. Oh, I, oh he said 4. I, I for some yes. reason thought he said 3. Okay. No. So, then all their alibis are out the window then. Except... except Soda and yours. Except me, Soda, and possibly Fuyuhiko. Poss no. Possibly. Because Fuyuhiko was also at 3.30. No. He was there right before the girls arrived. Mm. 
Again, that's why I said possibly. Because we saw him. We saw him right before the girls arrived. He looked flustered. There was no one with him. Up until that point. Again. And that was still 3.30. Possibly. Because we know that... We at least know that, um... Kyoko didn't do it. Because she was running away from the crime scene after seeing the murder. So... Well, she, we don't know that. We just know she's running away from the crime scene. But at least we can. In, I'm go, I'm gonna infer that because that seems also, like something she, she would do. Also, she didn't have blood all over her. She didn't have. Yeah, no, Akane did. But we already. Wait a second. Hmm. I'm thinking too much into this right well, now. Nekumaro, I should be reading Nekumaro, the Monokuma file. Nekumaro should be able to, you know, confirm or deny her alibi. Hmm. The scene of the crime where the body was discovered inside the beach house at Channel Beach. Okay. Cause of death is a single killing blow to the head with a blunt instrument. But this sounds so similar to the goddamn game. There's no other it's conspic conspic conspicuous external injuries and no trace of foreign substances substances such as drugs. This sounds so similar to the goddamn Yep, that's around the time that they have brought the diner. We've just gone to the beach house instead. No, now's the time now it's not the time to feel regret. I need to focus on doing as much as I can right now. Then I'm gonna find the truth behind Bahir's death. That's the only way the rest of us can survive. Alright. Look at the bat. Well, I need to examine everyone first. <clears throat> That's weird. What do you mean? <sighs> well, I wanted to calm myself down, so I thought about getting a drink from the refrigerator. Well, I opened it a few days ago. I'm pretty sure there was a large variety of drinks. Man. Well, I guess I'm just imagining things. I mean, who cares about drinks right now, huh? What are you talking about? <clears throat> Seriously, it's okay. I've resolved my own. I resolved it on my own, so just drop it. You started it. He's in the refrigerator. Well, the refrigerator. let's go to the refrigerator then. There's a lot of drinks inside the refrigerator, but compared to last time, I feel like there's less drinks. Do people take a lot of drinks from here? Not only that, the only drinks left in here either look sweetened or colored. They look unhealthy. Okay. Keep that Wait, in mind. What's, what drink's missing? This is suspicious, I think. What drink is missing? Did you find some kind of clue? See? You know the footprints from earlier. They were in front of the entrance facing the beach, right? Oh, that. Well? How'd you mean Kazuichi's footprints show you that you guys were the first ones to go inside the beach house? But these footprints are just the opposite. They're coming out of the beach house. Hey. That's true. Now that you mention it, I thought those footprints were a little strange, too. Dead? Uh, At first, I tried to go inside the beach house from the door facing the road, but it didn't open, so I went around and tried to go in the beach house door. The beach side door. You couldn't go inside the roadside door because Mahira's body was blocking it, right? Hmm. And that's when I noticed those footprints. Hmm. Why is the, the, the cabinet open? The footprints leading from the beach house to the tunnel that looked like they belonged to one person. Someone else's footprints leading outside of the beach house. Huh? Hmm. Now that you mention it, Peko said she went for a little swim, right? Could those footprints be... No, because where would she be? Well... Unfortunately, I went swimming to scout the first beach. I did not know anything about this beach. Yeah, Maybe. she wasn't there when we found that. Is that really true? She has no alibi. She doesn't have an alibi, but that beach... But if we're going off of what she said, she was swimming three hours. So that seems like an insane amount of time. It does, but... But we already established that shock, so... Yeah, she didn't know the Go. beach was here. But these footprints lead straight from the beach house to the tunnel. Since I was swimming at the beach, of course my footprints would lead from the shore to the tunnel. Huh? Whose footprints... Then whose footprints are these? It appears. It's no mistake they are the killer's footprints. I have no clue who that might be. Well, for now, it's obvious that this is a good clue, don't you think? It's probably very important. So let's get that truth bullet. We should look at the bat. The closet, the, closet. the closet's open. That's, yeah, it was closed all the way last time. That's a little suspicious. So I should probably investigate in here, too. Yeah, go in the closet. What's in here? And then come out of the closet. Oh, there's something on the floor. There's something right there on the floor. Let me, let me, let me add there's it. There's a flip-flop. This is a pretty suspicious walk-in closet, but there's so much crap on the shelves and the floor. There are wetsuits in here. Only one person can stand in here. 
But if you think about it this way, it means it's possible for only one person to stay in here. Oh no. There's something on the floor. This yellow thing is a gummy candy. Yoko said that she ate the gummies, mm -hmm. remember? <laughs> Finding candy on the floor in a place like this is clearly unnatural. If it's connected to the incident, did someone drop this while they were inside the closet? Hmm. That's interesting to know. What else can we investigate? The shelves. There's a lot of stuff jammed into the shelves, even the surfboards and the surfboard case. But they're not put away properly at all. Two surfboards are stuffed on in one shelf and some boards have been left out instead of being put in the case. Also, there's many surfboards, empty surfboards as well. Jeez, how careless. This is everything inside the closet. No, you didn't show the other side. Floating flotation devices, snorkels, nests, and there's paint also some supplies. paint supplies. There's not much else that can be related to the incident. Yeah. So there's not much else in there except for that gummy. That gummy was definitely important, though. That's good to know. Um. Okay. I'm a hero, I'm a hero, I'm a hero, I'm a hero, I'm a hero! This is too weird! Something like this should. Something this weird should only happen in song lyrics! What song would be. I found her sitting against the door, dead, beaten to death with the baseball bat. <laughs> You should, you should get you, you should get signed as a record contract for how good that song was. I will never forgive killing. Shaggy seems quite different than her usual self. Well, she she seemed to emanate this when the game was first appeared. She must feel very strongly about killing. It's not just Chiaki. There's no way anyone would forgive something like this. Hmm. I guess. You're right. Yeah, but she feels very strongly about it, which is different than what anyone else would normally do. Perhaps. My hero probably wants us to do this. She wants to reveal the truth behind her death. But what she really wanted, she probably wanted to spend time with all of us peacefully, without something like this happening. Let's check the murder weapon. It's a bat. The fatal blow was dealt with a blunt object. So, they don't specifically say it was a bat, but let's just assume that it is the bat. That's true. It's the same as the Twilight Syndrome murder case. Huh? Well? There's a girl named Girl E who was killed in the game during the fourth day. Um. Wow, that's a, that's a realistic image of what actually happened in the game. The girl was killed with a blow from a metal bat, just like my hero. But if the murderer played that game, couldn't they use it to fake that? Mm-hmm. Did you, Kinda like did you also play you? that game, Hajime? Is that why you were curious about that metal bat? Yeah, that's exactly it, but... Did you play it too? You did, didn't you? She had to have! She just spouted off all that information about it! And I'm sure you know this, but... The case this time strongly is connected to the Twilight Syndrome murder case, I think. In order to solve the mystery behind my hero's death, you should probably need to solve that game's mystery too. But even if you solve the game's mystery, all of the clues in it were lousy and useless. I mean, it started ambiguously, and it still is ambiguous when it ended. That's wrong. That's because you haven't beaten the game. Beaten? I finished the game with a game over, but you were you able to beat it? Mm. Mm. I'm not some girl gamer who talks about video games she's never beaten. What am I supposed to do to actually beat the game? I can't stop thinking about that for some reason. We're gonna go back and play it again. So we should ask all the people who's beaten the game and oh shit. We should ask the people who's already who's only seen the game or who's beaten the game and see how it ends. Cause that will probably also whittle down our choices of of suspects. So it's absolute so it's okay to say that this metal bat is absolutely the murder weapon, right? That sounds like a Thing that I would dispute later. Just because he's making assumptions and making assumptions makes asses out of you and me. There's a blood stain on the floor, and they're streaked as if she crawled through them. They're probably streaked from when Mahiro tried to run away during the attack. So she used all her energy to crawl away and took her last breath when she was leaning against the door. So that doesn't make sense. There's someone, so much blood on the door. Yeah, no. Did someone and the bats all the way over here? So did someone like? 
sta it, ha it they looks hit so her, sta they hit it her. It looks staged. When you think about it. Well, maybe, well, maybe she was murdered somewhere and then just all, they just fucking planted all the blood around her like that, because I don't imagine anyone doing like that and then just pushing her against the wall due to the fact that there's nothing there. It just seems off to me. What about the mask thing? I mean, that's what I try to investigate. Hmm? What's this? Is this a mask? Did someone bring this from the toy story? The toy collection of section of the supermarket maybe party goods regardless why is this even here could it be did the killer wear that to conceal their face maybe well, they totally stand out i mean it's such a gaudy mask um a gaudy mask huh? that mask oh wait a second <gasps> yeah. sun rich as burrito it's a super fun anime with the viewership surpassing 90% of my country. An anime that has a viewership of over 90%? Is Sunny's country really alright? No. It cannot be. C could it be? Was this mask placed next to the body? Who, who's Sun Es Who's Sun Man Esperito? Despacito. <laughs> Not the right song. Sun Witch Esperito. Yeah, it was. If that is true, could it, could it be? Maybe what? I'm sorry. Um, please give me some time. For reasons unknown, Sonya rushed into the beach house. It Her. Appears. It looks like she knows something. If that's the case, I shall wait until she decides to talk about it. Some. For Sonya to be so worked up, it must be something big. I wonder what she knows. Pretty anime girl mask. <laughs> Alright, let's check the actual body this time. <laughs> it's Hifumi. <laughs> Mahira was Hifumi the whole time! No, she was murdered by Hifumi. She was murdered- ugh. <laughs> she was murdered by the ghost of Hifumi. Yep. He was perving on her. So she-, she like, But she's not suicide. 2D enough. Anyway, she lost all her- <laughs> well, She lost all her life as if she was a shell. Is this really the energetic Mahira I knew? No, she's dead. I didn't... I didn't figure Mahira was energetic, but... Mm. I see her lying in front of me, but I just... <laughs> I still can't believe that your computer can make loud noises. That's not my computer! Well, my speakers are plugged... My headphones are not plugged in. Everybody. Yeah! Yeah, you asshole! It was coming from your direction! <laughs> I still can't connect this lifeless body to the high-spirited Mahiru. But, but we don't have time to wallow in sentiment. There's no way I could just stand here. I slap both my hands onto my cheeks and face Mahiru's body one more time. Mahiru is leaning against the beach house door that leads to the road. If she leaned onto the door like this, it would have been impossible to open. Maybe Mahiru tried to run away when she was attacked and tried to crawl to the door. Nah. Evidence can see the blood stain on the floor. Maybe. They're streaked as if she crawled through them. Maybe. Maybe? So, she used all her energy to crawl away, leaned against the door, and took her last breath. If someone as headstrong as to run, she must have felt really desperate. Okay, so now the Monokuma file's been updated. Can we go in the bathroom? We still, have, we still have other things to Holy check. Holy fuck! But we still have other things to check. This is the shower room. There's a notice on the door. Just from the illustration of it's being repaired. <laughs> That's right. The shower's being repaired so water won't come out. What about... What about hot water? Well, that's impossible, too. If the shower is out of order, then isn't it just a waste of space? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Just as I was planning to fix it, my magic stick was taken from me. So I never got around to fixing it. What the heck? What does your magic stick have to do with repairing? It's an abracadabra repairing stick. Anyway, it's all Monokuma's fault! Everything's all Monokuma's fault! <laughs> ah, you're doubtful! Eyes are telling me you think I'm Monokuma's accomplice! You must have read my mind. <laughs> think of what you want of me. I've already given up. But let me tell you this one more time. As long as you guys work together, you should be able to stay... It's any kind of despair! 
promise I will help with that. Yeah, you're doing the opposite. Well, anyway, it looks like the shower room is definitely out of order. I guess you should check inside. So if anyone brings it up, we can just refute it. What? What did I investigate? In the corner. There's a wastebasket thingy. What? The corner. They're, they're trash God, really? Maybe there's a clue inside this trash can that I barely saw. Holy shit! That's a lot of water bottles. Oh fuck, they were in there, weren't they? Mm-hmm. I don't see anything that looks like a clue. Guess it's not that easy, huh? I don't see anything that looks like a clue, so I'm gonna keep this clue in my truth bullets. Oh, the shower know. room was out of order. We had to go in the shower room. Why is Akira just in here? Oh, good. It's a really nice, spacious shower room. If this is huge, you could use it as a dressing room. But changing in the beach has forbidden. Jeez, what an unreasonable rule. Damn it. Guess there's no one in here. I was thinking the killer was hiding in here after he failed to escape. That wouldn't explain where the, uh, the footprints led. It wouldn't be that easy. Toilet! There's a toilet, but you really can't use it as a step stool. Why would you need to- Probably to get out of here. There's a window, but it's it's small, but maybe you can crawl out of it somehow. Probably doesn't mean That's anything. It's a fucking high-ass window. But it can't seem to take my mind off of it. That's gonna be a problem. However, the ceiling is really high, so the window is also situated at a very high place. It's so high, even if I stretch out my hand, I can't reach it. It's probably about nine feet up. And not just that, it's an iron-barred window, too. If that's the case. Yep, it'd be impossible to go in and out through there. What? Are you still thinking about that window? Yeah, I was just thinking the killer might have escaped through there. Leave it to me! Alright, I got it! I'll, I'll pitch in and help you out! Huh? Now then. Come on, give me a piggyback ride. I'll I'll check the window for you. Pitch in and help? Feels like I'm the one who's pitching in and helping. I'll pick you up! If you don't hurry up, I'll punch ya! She's really into this. No matter what I say, it's not gonna matter. Fine, I'll just leave it up to you. <laughs> Don't worry, my panties are clean. What? What? Totally related. What? I, I see. That's good. <laughs> oh, probably so that you can hold her up. I let her a deep sigh and then bent over under the window. All right! All right! And she shouted, "Not gonna jump onto my shoulders." Ugh. How is he doing that? That is insane. Hey! Your balance sucks! Make sure your stance is wider! Y you you're a lot heavier than I expected. Yeah, because I'm so buff. Like, every time I get a massage, they tell me I'm just a mass of muscles. It's true. A massage, huh? Do you have a trainer or something since you're the ultimate gymnast? Nah, I don't have a trainer. My stepmom's lovers like to get drunk and give me full body massages. Um, Thanks for that information, that, Akane. That's called molestation. <laughs> Shouldn't have asked. So, how's the window? Let's see. Hmm. I see, I see. So that's what happened. D did you find anything? Well, since there's this iron bar, I was pretty sure no one would be able to get through the window. But check it out. Ch check it out? Hold on. I'll give it a try. Knocking on my shoulders and cranked my neck so high that Crained, I not cranked! <laughs> I cranked my neck! Craned my neck. So it does open. This iron bar ain't even pinned down. Looks like you can open and close it pretty easy. Yeah, but how are you gonna get up there? See? My head can fit through, no problem. Yeah, and your big fucking head. Yeah, your head. Just your head. It's not impossible to go in and out of that window. Yep, yep. I'm gonna jump off my shoulders and flash a wide grin. <laughs> isn't this, this isn't this a big discovery? But the problem is, how are they able to reach that window? Yeah, I don't think you can get up to that window. But I mean, we had so much trouble getting up to that window. Even if I jumped, I can't really reach it. <laughs> but if two people worked together like us, it wouldn't be a problem, right? If that's the case, it would mean the killer had an accomplice. Huh? Accomplice? Sounds like a big word. Isn't that the name of a Kung Fu Master? Accomplice? Kung Fu Master. Accomplice? Ma 
Master Accomplice. Master... What funny reference is he trying to make? It's probably something that's similar to Accomplice. Yeah! I don't know. I honestly don't know. But even if there was an accomplice, the person acting as the step stool would be inside. Like. But if you really think about it, just one person could get out of here without help, right? Really? So. Yeah, like. I got it. A freaking ninja could do it, you know? A ninja can climb fences and walls, no problem, right? Just as I thought. It looks difficult to go in and out of that window. <laughs> what the heck? And I even got the time to lend you my wisdom. Me off. You're the one who said it was suspicious, so I took the time to pitch in and help. You. <laughs> Such a waste of time to help you out. All you saw were my panties. Judging by the way that the angle was sh uh, shot at, I don't think he no, even got. I don't got, think he did. He I just, don't think he got even anywhere close to a look. You just got to feel your thunder thighs against his neck. Mm. No, I didn't. <laughs> oh well, it's not like it's the end of the world. I'm telling you, I didn't look at them. She wouldn't have cared anyway. Okay, I guess it's pretty much everything in the shower room, and I guess I've finished investigating everything. But there's still not enough. Just from the clues here, I don't think I have enough to find the truth. It looks like they're trying investigating that again to find out why Mahiro got killed. The game. Girl, he was killed in that game by a single blow from a metal bat. Metal bat, the same weapon that was used to kill Mahiru. That, there's no way, there's just a coincidence. Mm -hmm. Missing oh, link. It's it's a killer's motive for the killing this Chris, time. It's it's a um the murder kung fu master accomplice is kung fu master acopiamente. <sighs> I'm literally legit. I don't have time to pronounce that, but that's what it is. Acopiamente. That's legit. Why do you spell Kung Fu with two O's? Because I felt like it. By the way. Oh, no, I don't want English results only. Person who might know about that mystery game is standing right next to me. Ah. <laughs> I should ask her about it. Okay, so the metal bat was updated. Okay, now I can leave. So next time on the investigation episode, we're gonna actually investigate more by talking to Chiaki. We'll see you guys later for an actual outro for when we figure out who killed Mahiro and maybe go to the trial, I don't know. Bye!